Welcome or welcome back on C Square. In this video clip, we're going to talk about dividing complex numbers. And we look to these two problems, 67 and 68. In problem 67, we have to divide a complex number, 3 minus 2i, right? 3 minus 2i divided by 5i. Yeah. Instead of dividing complex number like the problem says, we're going to multiply. And now be careful what you multiply by in this case. In this case, we multiply by i over i. This is nothing else than the number 1, right? So we can multiply by 1 because, in fact, we change nothing. And what do we get here? We have 3 times i, which is 3i. 2i times i, which is 2i squared, and down on the bottom, the denominator becomes 5i squared. Okay? And do not forget that i squared is nothing else than negative 1. So we can do some replacement here, and we're going to have 3i minus becomes plus, in fact, right? 2 times negative 1, negative 2 times negative 1 is positive 2 over negative 5. And one last thing, I mean, in fact, two things. Let's break the fraction. 3i over negative 5 plus 2 over 5. And in fact, we like to write the answer in this format. The real part first, 2 fifths minus 3 fifths i. Okay, so the answer for the first problem is 2 fifths minus 3 over 5, 3 fifths i. Always you have, you have the answer in this format of a real part, in this case 2 fifths, and imaginary parts, in this case negative 3 fifths. Pause this video clip and go and try to do number 68. If you end up with this solution, 4 minus 3, I, you did a wonderful job. Let's go to this, another case of dividing complex number. If you notice here, we have, in fact, two complex numbers, 4 minus 3i and negative 1 minus 4i. Again, if you notice, we do not really divide, we multiply by We multiply again by that uh, 1. Uh, be careful how you uh, create that 1. Uh, if you notice, I use the conjugate of the bottom complex number. Negative 1 minus 4i. The conjugate is going to be negative 1 plus 4i. That will be the denominator of the fraction that we multiply by. And copy that denominator on the top of the fraction for the numerator. And then you have that uh, 1 uh, we can multiply, we can keep this equal sign. 
So now we're going to use foil for the top, and we get negative 4 plus 16i plus 3i minus 12i squared. And for the bottom complex number denominators, we're going to use the shortcut, which is says uh, negative 1 squared plus or square. We square each part of the complex number, the real part and the imaginary part. Uh, so for the top we're going to end up with negative 4 plus 19i plus 12, right? Because i squared is negative 1, don't forget that. Squared equals negative 1. Now on the bottom we get to uh, 1 plus 16. So we end up with uh, 8 plus 99 over 17. And the final answer would be always in this form. 8 plus E I. In other words, a real part and the imaginary part needs to be uh, shown when you write your answer. Um, and also, don't forget about simplification. If you need to simplify, simplify. Okay, go ahead and pause this video, people, and try number 70. If your answer for number 70 is 3 over 5 plus 4 over 5 high, then you did a wonderful job. If you enjoyed this video clip, don't forget to click the like button down right and come back on C-square for more math video clips. Thank you.